Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. In this video, I'll discuss one more DFA problem that is to design a DFA that reads strings made up of C H A R I O T and recognize those strings that contain cat as a substring. Okay, so it is a slightly different one because uh, in, in the previous examples we have taken only uh, two input alphabets, but in this one we are taking uh, more than two alphabets. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have, we have seven alphabets, and uh, in this one we need to accept only those strings which contain cat as a substring. Okay, so uh, to complete this DFA, I need to have exactly seven paths from every state. Okay, so from, from every state, I should have a path for C, H, A, R, I, O, T. So all the paths should be there and the string should contain cat as a substring. So let's first of all try to understand what kind of language do we have and what is the shortest possible string that we can, we can have in this one. Okay, so the shortest possible string that we can have is cat only. Okay, so in the language, first of all, we have C, A, T that is a mandatory requirement. Okay, now apart from this what we can have now we can have like C or we can have H or we can have A or we can have anything before the cat. Okay, or we can have anything like C, H, A, R, I, O any character after the cat also. Okay, and Plus we can have like C A oh sorry C C A T okay or we can have C A C A T or we can have C A T C A T so all those strings we have to accept in which cat is there cat can be there once or it can be there twice it can be there thrice any number of times cat can be there and apart from this all these combinations should be there okay so let's start a dfa for this one okay so it is saying that the shortest possible string in this case is cat only so cat has three characters so for three characters i need four states at least four states i need so i'll take four states and then we'll try to incorporate all the other options in that one okay so start from q naught that is this q naught and from q naught to q1 go with c okay then q1 to q2 go to go with a and q2 to q3 make this q3 as final go with t so we have c a t okay so minimum string we are accepting it so now let's complete this dfa to complete this dfa from every state, I should have exactly seven paths. One for C, one for H, one for A, R, I, O, T. So all the paths should be there. Okay. So on Q naught, I have one path for C. How many paths are left? Still six paths are left. And I said that before this cat, I can have anything. I can have anything. Like we can have H also, A also, R also, R, I also, O, T. Anything I can have here. So what I'll do, I'll simply take a self loop here and it will be c comma h comma a comma r comma i comma o comma t so uh, no not c c will not be there because c we have already taken here so we have h a r i o t so all these paths will be there so q you naught know, is complete so with this one i can accept any string in which at the end we have a cat and before the cat i can have anything okay now let's come to q1 so at q1 we have only path for a we need a path for c also h also r i o t six paths we need now suppose the string that i have is c c a t okay so we have c c a t so from q naught i'll start with c now c is done now at q1 i have a and t it is saying we can have c again so what i can do in this case so simply i will add a self loop of here with c that is it will accept c c c c a t also that is c c c c c a t and in this one cat is still preserved okay so till now it is correct so one path is done for q1 one path is done c is done a is done what is left we have h r i o t all the other paths are left i need to preserve this cat 
okay so what i'll do i'll simply come from q1 to q0 with the remaining characters that is h r i o and t so h r i o t so with this one what strings i can accept i can accept like this c c h a c okay then a t so cat is there it should be accepted let's check this out so c c okay it is c c so c c then h then a then c a t so this is getting accepted okay so q naught is done q1 is done now come to q2 so at q2 what i need i need to check that at this point also cat should be preserved now suppose the string that i have is c a c a t so i have c a c a t so let's check it out c a and now we are stuck i'll again simply with c i will come here that is c a c a t so c a c a t so this is getting accepted okay so for q2 two paths are done c is done t is done what is left s is left a is left r i o all are left okay so what i'll do i'll simply from q2 i'll come to q0 with the remaining characters and the remaining characters are h a r i o okay so with all these characters i can come to q0 now with this one what strings i can accept suppose i have a string as c a then i c a t okay so c a i and c a t so this is getting accepted now q2 is done for q2 we have added all the paths one for c one for t and one for, uh, this is for the remaining paths now what is left q3 now q3 i told you that after this cat i can have anything i can have any combination of the alphabets so what i'll do i'll simply add a self loop here c h a r i o t so q3 is also done and with this dfa i can accept any string made of the letters c h a r i o t that contain cat as a substring okay thank you so much